It's wonderful to see more than 120 students across diverse disciplines from our local universities and polytechnics participating in this inaugural Maritime Digital Challenge. Over the past few weeks, our participants tackled different challenges from Eastport Maritime use of gamification to develop a platform for onboarding and training, Kanda's challenge of using virtual reality in maritime operations training, and Tobert Klafner's challenge of creating an app for seafarers to input data for sustainable shipping insights. been very insightful like what Gabriel mentioned we're actually a diverse team and it's really good when we do our discussions and development that the tech explains to the maritime side and the maritime does the same for the tech so it's like an exchange of information and not to mention with all the mentoring sessions along the way we also gather a lot of insights about the maritime industry itself so I think for the five of us it's definitely be a journey of like learning and obviously uh, going through this journey together as a team. So through this competition, we actually understand more about the industry, the difficulties they face, and what are the common challenges that employees have when onboarding to this kind of industry. As I know, not many of the students here even are maritime industry students. So we take this opportunity very seriously and we learn about a lot about the maritime industry and also I think um, further appreciate our maritime industry employees and workers. Yeah. To come up with that standard of work at that stage in their education is simply outstanding. I've never seen anything like this before. Uh, this, this is something you would expect from uh, people with maybe five or ten years experience. Uh, they were all very, very professional and yeah, it just blew my mind that uh, people of this age can produce work of that quality. So first I must, uh, I must commend the teams because we have seen very impressive proposals in the short span of time that they have to come up with the proof of concept, right? They have done so much beyond just the basic proposal. We have seen teams uh, use even videos, you know, that uh, really enhance the, the proof of concept. We learned from Eastern Pacific that the seafarers only uh, undergo training once every one to two years, and they will go overseas for that. So there's a lot of expenses, there's a lot of cost. And what's more is that the uh, majority of the learning facilities in academies are really outdated, which is a major pain point that we tried to step on, which is why we introduced VR and uh, scalability. So that was the key of our components. It's, it's really amazing about people who are not close to the subject matter or I guess to VR development, how creative they can be. Well, it's been absolutely fantastic. I've been blown away by the enthusiasm, the creativity, the quality of what the, both teams have delivered. It's been a real pleasure.